my behind. No. <laughs> Here we have the spoiled brats, don't forget the crown, they probably got it from Burger King. Hey you, give me your cell phone. No. Give it to me, or I'll beat you at- <laughs> What? I'll beat you! This is the last one and the most cringe one. This is the heater. He is very dangerous. Oh my god! Hey guys, what's up? It's Eternal, and today I am back with another one of these types of gotcha character videos where we focus on different types of gotcha characters. Last episode of this, I did gotcha club pets, and a lot of people in the comments suggested that I check out the gotcha stereotype zoo because it basically introduces us to every single type of gotcha character, and they're all in a zoo, which like, I don't know the ethics of that. Like, are we allowed to put gotcha characters in a zoo? zoo like the only characters i can see being in a zoo is in a woo cat well bad ones at least because you need to lock them up immediately if there's like chill gotcha characters like do they have to be in the zoo so uh, this is gonna be so exciting we're gonna react to it together and yeah without further ado let's just get right into this you can't get rid of me babe. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do is search gotcha zoo on youtube let's search gotcha well at least gotcha life 2 comes up that's pretty good okay i'm quite concerned about this we're just gonna ignore it and and search gotcha zoo okay so i found this one gotcha stereotype zoo the complete adventure all parts 36 minutes that's like a lot of minutes <laughs> So this is the Gotcha Stereotype Zoo, The Complete Adventure by Neko Sunny. Hello dear visitors. Welcome to Gotcha Stereotype Zoo. My name is Sunny. I am your guide today. Oh, Sunny is so cute. Please follow me for the tour. Here we have the Yu Wu and Owo -Oh cats. Oh no! It looks like they just woke up. Yn, look. It's coming close. Meow, Yu Wu. Please give me my bad boy, Yeah. No. <laughs> No. no. Uh, let's move on. Here we have the spoiled brats. Don't forget the crown. They probably got it from Burger King. <laughs> not the Burger King crown. Oh my god. I thought you were the zookeeper, not the person that ends these guys' whole career. This is the alpha boyfriend. BF of the Yu Wu or Owo cat. They are half demon, half wolf most of the time. They are very overprotective of their BF and also pretty dangerous. Give me my kitten back. It's Jakey Boo Boo Bear. Here we have the softy. They wear clothing too big for humanity. Aww. Also, why Sunny's accent changed? YN, look. It's coming close. Here we have the softy. They wear clothing too big for he That's real talent right there. They are upset way too easily, so be careful what you say. They also think it's quirky to be addicted to cookies. <laughs> okay, me. Oh, God, it's voice. These softies are very alike to the cookie, kawaii, and potato species, and kind of alike to the awu and awu cats as well. They react the same when you take their stuff. I think the gotcha softy style is actually like really adorable, but I get how some of them can be cringe. Here is the cringy Yandere girl. Most of these think they are the hottest person ever. Well, I hate to break it to ya, but no. Oh, Sunny is roasting the gotcha characters right in front of their faces like, dang. Here are the emos. They wanted the whole cage black. They hate pink and skirts more than anything and are very edgy. It's because pink and skirts are for losers. Wow. I love pink and skirts, so I'm offended. Welcome back. We've got a lot of new species. Sunny's voice changed back. And before you ask what happened, I got attacked while trying to feed the Yuwu cats. Only because I didn't want to give them their bad boy BF. <laughs> Sunny, look over there. Okay, YN, be very quiet. I will try to capture it. Yay, we finally have a female Yuwu cat. Wait, so are, are we just going around the gacha community capturing different types of people? Like, if it was just existing and nice, like, should it have went in the zoo? I don't know, so maybe someone can answer me in the comments. Here we have the totally not me teachers. When the characters go to school, they are the teachers. They aren't too smart mostly and are made to make people laugh, but it quickly became an overused joke. Today we are learning about math, 
thing. Hey, I still think that's pretty funny, not gonna lie. You'll need this. Oh, I thought you were about to put us in the cage, because, like, your name is a type of gotcha character. Here we have the eye blue oh! hybrid. They wear every color in existence and mostly neon as well. I am a wolf, demon, angel, dragon, human, etc. Here are the only one main color, people. Nothing much to say. Their name explains it. They look cool. Here's the hated child who is the lost princess. Let's go before it starts singing. Oh, no. Oh, you poor thing. You don't look happy. Do you want me to give you new clothes? Okay, let me get some new clothes for you. Oh, I guess we're not capturing all of them. We're fixing this one. Aww, that's cute and awesome. Here we have the ones who use a preset as their OC. My OC is very creative. No, it's literally a preset. Are there people that genuinely do that? <laughs> Here are the people who talk with their mouth closed. Hello. That's what I mean. Kinda creepy if you <laughs> see it up close and GL. Okay, okay. I admit I was once one of these. Same. These are very common. When they make their OC, they only choose of the first or second page. I was one of these. The species makes an OC and puts it in a fandom like they were always there. Many are seen in Affin family videos. They make themselves a part of the Affin family. Me, listen, because I'm the Affin family dog, as everyone knows. Wow, I did this. Here we have the pick me girls. We have more, but the others seem to be asleep. <sighs> I'm so ugly, sad face. Yes, you're correct. You are indeed ugly. <laughs> Here we have the weird cores. Their name explains it. Oh my god, I love weird core characters. There's nothing much I can say about this guy except for that he is the definition of my eyes are up here. <laughs> All stereotypes who wanted to go were set free after their stay, and so the day came to its end. <gasps> Wait a minute, so it's like a hotel! It's not even like really like a zoo! This answered my question from before, if they're like just captured and stuck there the rest of their life. I hope you enjoyed the tour. Thanks for letting me be your tour guide. Take care. Aw, thank you, Neko Sunny, for introducing us to the many gotcha characters of the gotcha world. This was an extremely good video, and I had to cut it down for time's sake, of course. So go to Neko Sunny's channel and check out the full video. Next, I found Gotcha Stereotype Zoo by iLotus, so let's watch. Welcome to the Gotcha Stereotype Zoo. Does everyone have their bleach guns? Uh, I didn't think it was that serious. We needed bleach guns, but, um... Our first exhibit is the UW cat. These are our spoiled brats. They live in groups of two or three and will keep crying until they get what they want. Hey, you. Give me your cell phone. No. Give it to me or I'll beat you at... <laughs> what? I'll beat you. What? This is our demon bad boy. Oh, it's got its eyes on you, Gemma. Spray it with bleach. Oh my god, I didn't know that they growled like lions. Also, why is her name Gemma? Gemma's such a funny name. Gemma? Shout out to everyone named Gemma. This is our hybrid princess. There are different types of hybrids. Evolved and born. This one's evolved. They transform by singing fight song or royalty on a school roof. <laughs> transformation i'm gonna transform into a hybrid princess girl this is my fight song oh my god it worked i hope you enjoyed the visit that was a great tour i lotus i did enjoy the visit very good job also please someone change me back i don't want to be stuck like this forever next let's watch the gotcha stereotype zoo oh <laughs> Gaja Club, not original, by Mushroom Wave. Hello, I'm Mint, and today I'll be your tour in the Gacha Stereotype Zoo. So let's start, but first take your bleach. Wait, why are these ones supplying us with bleach? I don't think we need it. We're not gonna be cleaning clothes or bathrooms, and I don't think we should be spraying it at bad boys. <laughs> but, um... These are loony fangirls. Oh my god. Nothing else to say. Let's go to the next one. This is the last- Wait, we need to- Hey, we need to get him out of the cage! Why are you just gonna leave him there? I think we need to save him. This is the last one and the most cringe one. This is the heater. He is very dangerous. Oh 
my god. Well, at least he's in solitary confinement because I agree he is the most dangerous. You know what? I think I really need to clean my gotcha galaxy girl shirt. So that was all. Hope you didn't need bleach. Well, I totally do now to clean my gotcha galaxy girl shirt, of course. <laughs> but all jokes aside, that was pretty good. So now that we've got an idea of the different types of gotcha stereotypes, I decided I would pick one and try to make my character in that style. And the one I picked was the people who make the characters primarily one color because I don't think I'll dedicate a video to those type of characters, but they are super cool. So I'm gonna be using Gotcha Life 2. Let's just start. All right, so first I'm gonna start out with my Gotcha preset. I just wanna say that she is so, so cute. Thank you, whoever made this possible. Yeah, I just wanna say thank you anyway. She's so cute, I love her. And whoa, okay, I didn't mean to do that. Um. <laughs> Okay, so we're changing her hair up a little bit, making her a little bit different. We gotta change the color, and my primary color, of course, is gonna be pink or purple? Pink purplish? I know, that's not one color, but... And I'm changing up her outfit a little bit. And here we go. Now she's primarily pink, purple, and magenta. Wow, that's not one color. Now I'm ready to go in the zoo. Now let's watch The Gotcha Zoo Part 1 by The Creative Arts. We will be going to the safe creatures first. It also has the most cutest creatures. This is the Marmari. They look like axolotls, but they're very different. Oh, they're cute. They love to eat plankton and small fish. They love to eat plankton. Do duo. Do do. Into the dangerous cage. Do duo. First, we are meeting fire tigers. They should not be petted. Oh my God! They're fighting. There it is. And no, it's not the fox. It's going to do it. It's transforming. Oh, just wait. That was unexpected. Anyways, on the next R. Oh, it's still in development. Goodbye, my fellow customers. Wow, okay, so we got to learn about some cool animals in the gotcha community now. Those were cool. Anyways, guys, thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe for more. Subscribe, become part of the Cooler Gang, and I will see all of you Cooler Gang in the next gotcha video. Comment what you want to see next. Peace, y'all. Welcome to Gotcha Live, there's so much to see.